Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, Allie's Amazing Scents. If you're new here, my name is Allison, your independent Scentsy consultant, and today I'm super excited to share with you the summer collection for summer 2022. So let's get started. Okay, I opened this box because um, I was going to try to do this video with Maya, my uh, soon-to-be five-year-old, and um, that just wasn't working. So before we really got into it, I was like, okay, let's uh, let's find something else to do. Uh, so I have 22 items on the list here, which should all be in here. That's how many I ordered. Um, we'll start out with the oils. So Scentsy in a lot of their collections, um, it's usually they'll have these oil three packs. So it's usually um, Valentine's Day. Does Mother's Day collection have one? No. Father's Day usually does. Summer, harvest, holiday. Um, so we get them a few times a year and they come in this little tin. And this set is called Sweet Sunshine. And oops, they have three oils in them. So these are perfect for gifting. Um, the oils are smaller than our regular catalog items. These are five milliliters rather than 15. So the first one we have here is Beach Berry Smoothie. And this is a sweet blend of juicy beach berry and vanilla cream garnished with lime leaves. Ooh, yes, it's berries. That's good, it's sweet berries. Um, and it is sometimes hard to get a good idea of what an oil smells like when you just smell it in the bottle like that because it's so concentrated uh, before you diffuse it. But I like that, that's sweet berries and, and um, kind of a creamy note, that's good. So this one is purple, so I love the packaging and it's jasmine and coca bolo. I think is how you say that. I'm probably going to mispronounce a lot of things in this video, just an FYI. But jasmine and coca bolo, calming jasmine and coca bolo wood wrapped in soft banana leaf. That sounds amazing. Okay, so this is not exactly what I was expecting. I'm getting a lot of, uh, it must be the jasmine. It is a like a powdery floral. Um, not horrible, but if you don't like powdery florals, you might not like this one. I don't know. I'm going to have to diffuse it and see. Um, and you do have to get the oils all together in the three packs. So, um, that is, that is one thing you can't pick and choose on them. And then the last one we have is another one I'm probably going to say wrong. Calam, calamansi and coconut, calamansi and coconut. Bright calamansi and zesty orange peel cool off with a splash of coconut water. I'm getting a lot of orange with this. But a bitter note too, like the, the orange peel type smell. And once again, that bitterness might come off when I... Um, diffuse it and mix it with water, but that's what I'm smelling right now. So, um, I'm just by smelling them, I would say the beach berry is my favorite and then the jasmine one, which is the floral one. And then the calamansi and coconut, just because to me that smells like a pretty standard orange scent, um, just in here as it is. So those are the oils. Um, I love the summertime oils, so that's exciting. Okay, um, I got, this is what I pulled out last time, um, when I tried to record the first time, a, um, pink, uh, pink, a blue light bulb, blue 25 watt light bulb. I just, I wanted that for a warmer that I have going right now. Um, and so now we'll get into the, the bars, but I do have one bar here that's not, um, part of the summer collection, but I wanted to pick it up and try it. And this is blue from the Chase Rainbows collection, which I believe is still currently available. And I've heard that this is like a clean laundry scent. Hmm. 
Yeah, that's nice. And I like when they do the, um, like, metallic silver on the inside of the clamshells. I don't know why, but that's fun. So, that is a clean laundry. I get maybe a tiny bit of a floral. Maybe I do get a little bit of an aquatic, I believe. You know what? I'm going to look this up really quick. Um... Because I have, let's see here, what is this called? Blue. That's going to probably pull up like everything. <laughs> 58 products for blue. Okay, blue Scentsy Bar is Sweet Notes. Oh, melon. That's what I'm smelling. Melon, shimmer against a crisp blue sky while hints of musk add depth and dimension. So you have melon blue sky, whatever that is, and musk. That must be laundry now. But now that it says melon, I totally am smelling the melon. It kind of smells like the melon in inhale, exhale. Um, but even if you didn't like that, don't let that um, stop you from trying this because this is just, it's there, but it's still more of a clean scent overall. So I really like that. I think it'll be a good performer. Um, I'll probably try it out in my open concept. Is it club worthy at this point? I can't say <laughs> without warming it. Um, it might be. We'll see. That's blue. Not mad about getting that. So let me hop back over here to the summer collection. Um, summer collection. And I want to check and see if everything's still available. Yeah, everything's still available. Um, I did not get it any of the buddies. There's a really cute toucan buddy and a couple um, bitty buddies and then um, a full size and a mini cactus warmer that are really cute. It would go nice in my office, um, but I, I don't need any more warmers. So I got everything else though, pretty much. So let's start with um, the wax. So there's four cents in the summer collection and all of them are available in wax. And then various products for each scent. So we'll start with the wax since it's all four scents. Um, this one is actually, um, I picked this up for a friend. She wanted to try this. This is Feelin' Punchy. And um, I didn't get it because I usually don't like fruit punch. Um, this is, well, let me smell it first. That's very fruit punch. <laughs> Oh yeah, with like an orange note. So this is described as bright tangerine, that must be the orange, and pink lemon with a sweet splash of fruit punch. Don't really get the pink lemon. I do get the tangerine, but it's mostly that fruit punch. It's more than a splash. <laughs> so if you like fruit punch scents, I think you'll like this. I think it's gonna be a decent performer. Um, and they do have it in bathroom cleaner and actually I think that this would be a really nice scent in, um, bathroom clean. So, and counter clean. But that's the, uh, feeling punchy. The next one, really excited about this. This is cucumber and cactus water. So this I'm thinking will be a fresh clean scent. Look at the color of the wax. It's that dark green. Beautiful. Oh my gosh, yes. Yes, yes. This is so good. I want to smell it next to um, blue, even though they're totally different. I like this better. Um, it's fresh. Clean fresh with like a green. It's like a green clean fresh. Maybe a little bit of aloe in there. Let's see what Sensi says. That is wonderful. Um, cucumber and cactus water is crisp cucumber wades into refreshing cactus water and sea salt. So cucumber, cactus water, and sea salt. That's good. I don't think it's as strong on cold as the blue bar. Um, I'm not sure how this is going to do performance wise. 
but I'm going to be changing out all my wax into these um, so I can let you guys know. And uh, it might not be open concept worthy. I don't know. But I really like that one. The next one. Oh, another bar of that for my friend. I'll put it in her pile. Peachy and palm trees. I'm also excited about this one. Um, I think it's going to be... Just like a nice summery peach scent. Ooh. That's good. That's stronger than I was expecting. I was expecting something pretty light, like, um, I'm drawing a blank, but whatever the peach one is that we have in the catalog. Um, oh, why can't I think of it? Anyway, I was thinking it would be lighter like that, but on cold, it smells pretty good. It actually kind of reminds me of um, Ruby Nectarine, the scent of the month for this month, for May. Wait, maybe that was a scent of, that was a scent of the month for April. I'm sorry. Kind of reminds me of that, though. Mm. Be because it's fresh. It has, like, the... It's not like a candied peach. It's, like you bite into a peach and you're smelling it with the all the stringiness and stuff to it. That's what this reminds me of, like an authentic peach smell. I don't know what else is in there. It's pretty, pretty much just um, like a fresh peach to me, to my nose. Uh, since he says sweet peach and mango, Add a tangy twist to smooth coconut milk. That mango must be what's um, pushing it, giving it that extra oomph of it, that it needs. I do kind of get that. And maybe, you know, it's probably because I just read that. But I do get a little bit of that mango. But this is really good. Um, on cold, I like it better than the Ruby Nectarine. Ruby Nectarine was nice, but I it wasn't strong enough for me. Um, so I'm hoping that this will be a little bit stronger, but yeah, I really like that one. Um, and then another bar of that. And then the last bar we have, I just have one bar of, and this is something I'm probably going to mispronounce. Uh, Kuki, Kuki, K-U-K-U-I, Kuki, and Coconut. I know I'm not saying that right. Yes. This is the one that I thought that I would like the most. And I might. <laughs> They're all, well, almost all of them I really like. Uh, this, I'm getting, I'm definitely getting that coconut. It kind of reminds me a little bit of coconut, and, coastal sunset, that type of coconut. Like maybe there's a woodsy note in here with the coconut it does remind me that it's really nice um i it's a little bit smoother i think than coastal sunset lately i've been giving a little bit of like an astringent note in coastal sunset that i never used to get okay this is described as do, 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 tropical coconut and kukia nut lounge on a bed of soft jasmine. So you have coconut, jasmine, and then that other nut, which must be giving it the woods type scent. So I don't know how to pronounce that, um, but I have a friend that grew up in Hawaii. And when this collection came out, I sent her like a picture of this and I said, have you heard of this nut? And she said, oh yeah, it grows all over at least where she was at in Hawaii, which I think was the big island. She said it grows all over and um, people, the locals use it. They use the nuts to make jewelry and stuff like necklaces. So that was cool to hear that story. But I'm a long ways from Hawaii. So <laughs> this, this might be the closest I get for a while. Anyway, that's gorgeous. Okay, so I, I think I'm going to try that in my bedroom. Um, my order of bars from, um, 
We'll start with least favorite. Least favorite is feeling punchy just because I'm not, you know, that type of gal. Ooh, here's where it gets hard because I love all the other ones. Um, mm, This is going to be tough. Okay. Ooh, I don't know. I guess maybe... Peachy and palm trees would be my next favorite. Um, and then cucumber and cactus water. And then I think this one is going to be my favorite. So I'm going to have to watch some videos and see how people are pronouncing it. Because <laughs> if I like it, I got to know how to say it. It also gives me a little bit of um, summer holiday vibes. I think summer holiday has jasmine in it. I know it has tiger lily. Yeah, a little bit like coastal sunset slash summer holiday vibes. Really nice. And I'm glad that I got this in some of the body line because I think it's going to be really nice in body. Um, a lot of the products were available. Well, body, I think it was this scent and the um, peachy and palm trees. And I went with this one for my body stuff. So I'm glad that I did. Okay, uh, we have... Oh, I guess I got the hand creams. I got one of each. So one of each for the hand creams. I'm really excited about that. This collection didn't have any body um, cream, like the large ones. I don't think so, because I would have got them. But um, it has these, which is supposed to be the same formulation, just a smaller bottle size, hand cream versus body cream. And this is interesting. If you look at, it doesn't have it on the clamshell, but the body it has the little um like hula dancers and so that actually aligns with what my friend was saying so that's funny anyway and then the um artwork on this is you know some peaches and stuff so really cute um i'm assuming those smell like the bars and then i got pods i got a three pack of pods so i got the three cents that i that I like. Um, ooh, see, that smells really nice in the pod. And actually, in the pod, I'm getting more of the vibes of, like, summer holiday. Yeah. Um, in the Scentsy End of Month Live, Lacey from Home Office said that this smell kind of, to her, smelled like um, Boom Boom Cream. Sol J D. Janeiro. I'm probably not saying that right either, but it's like a popular uh, body product. And um, she said that about this. I don't know because I've never smelled that, but I could, I mean, this does smell body care-esque. Oh, that is so good. If you like summer holiday, I think you'd really like this. Um, and then I also got, oh, see that smells really, um, that almost smells stronger in the pods too. The cucumber and cactus water. That's just a really nice clean scent. Um, and not like necessarily clean laundry, more like green clean. And then peachy and palm trees. That also smells pretty strong in the pot. I think all of these pots are going to be good performers. And I'm guessing that the feeling punchy probably would too, because that smelled pretty strong in the box. Okay, so... Um, the other body product I got is, um, I got the nut I'm mispronouncing, I'm sure, Kukui, Kukui, I think that's it, Kukui, Kukui and Coconut. Um, and this is a Scentsy Soak, so Scentsy Soak, they're two pounds, and they're like this fine powder, it's a bath soak, it's made with Epsom salt and pink Himalayan bath salts. Really nice, um, this stuff will not stain your tub. It does not irritate sensitive skin in our experience here at our house. And, um, yeah, so I had to get one of these. I really, we love the Scentsy Soak here. And I'm just uh, getting distracted by the beautiful design on here. The dancers and the floral. It's just, it's so pretty. So, excited for that. And then I got three fragrance flowers, and I actually don't remember what scents I got. Cucumber and cactus water. 
another cucumber and cactus water, and um, peachy and palm trees. Um, I think those were the only two scents that they had in fragrance flowers. And fragrance flowers are on sale this month. They're $12 instead of $16 for individual. I don't remember what the three pack comes out to, but it's 20% off. Individual or bundle and save with the three pack is 10% off or 20% off. I think it's like 36 instead of 45 or something. Um, but it's a really good deal and that's going on through the end of May. So it's a great time to um, stock up on some fragrance flowers. So then we have some laundry products in here. We have, um, they chose to release, uh, a lot of times they'll do um, a laundry scent in um, the summer line. And you usually get a washer with, and or a uh, laundry liquid and two tubs of washer with. So um, this year they did the uh, cucumber and cactus water. So you, and you, this does come as a set. Pretty much everything you can buy individually. I mean the oils, you gotta buy the whole three pack tin. And then the laundry, it comes in this set. Everything else you can get individual. But the laundry is, oops, that's the wrong bottle. The laundry is $40, I think, for the set. And you get um, one laundry liquid, which is your detergent, and then you get two small tubs of washer whiffs. So since he makes two sizes of these, this is the small tub. You get two of these. And this is what's going to fragrance your laundry. Uh, we do have a couple other laundry products that can be used in conjunction with these things, but this is what you get in this pack. Mmm. Yeah, that's nice. That's good. And if you have any um, aloe water, aloe, cucumber, aloe water and cucumber <laughs> um, laundry leftover from when it was in the catalog that you're using, this I think would complement it really well. Um, I have some scent soft left in that that I'm going to use with this. Um, but you don't need to. That just gives your clothes some extra softness. The, this is a really nice laundry scent. Um, Definitely the right choice for laundry out of these four cents. And then the last thing that I got, oh wow, did something leak in here? Everything has felt dry, but look, I have this like, ring stain thing right there. Okay. Um, the last thing that I got is the Scentsy Fresh. So this is an odor eliminating fabric spray. And then again, it's in that um, cucumber and cactus water scent. So Scentsy Fresh, um, this year I feel like they've been promoting it more with like limited time offer scents in um, Scentsy Fresh. But um, it's kind of like, it's like Febreze fabric softener. So you can spray it on anything fabric. Um, and it's really nice for things that are difficult to wash, like couches, um, upholstery in your car, um, rugs in between washes, curtains. You can even spray it, you know, in your closet just to freshen up your clothes that are hanging. Um, it won't stain or leave marks or anything. I'm actually going to open this right now because I want to smell it. Um, and... They last quite a while. Um, I also like to take it traveling for when I go into a hotel room because you just never know, especially if you're staying in a pet friendly room. Um, oh, great. I just spilled some on my pants. Well, I guess my pants will be nice and um, fresh smelling. Ooh, that is just so nice. It kind of also reminds me Hmm, a little bit along the lines of um, the bamboo scent that we had for the scent of the month um, for February. A little bit of that. Okay, so maybe I should open the, the nozzle here. That's so light and fresh and airy. It's, it's perfect for summer. So that's it. That is my summer collection haul. Um, 
Let me know if you guys got anything or what you're looking forward to trying from the summer collection. And um, thank you for watching. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to my channel. Thanks, guys. I'll talk to you later. Bye.